Ladies and gentlemen, do not be fooled. We look like we're in a different location, but we're not quite. We're just shifted across the room. That doesn't matter though, because today we are going back to an OG, an absolute original gangster video. We are looking at Would You Rathers because no ideas this week. I may as well be honest. <laughs> um, so we, today we are going to look at some potentially controversial slash difficult decisions to make in a world where these aren't actually going to happen. It's just for entertainment purposes. Sorry to burst your excitement bubble. Okay, would you rather have a personal chef or a personal masseuse? Now chef, that would be lovely because I won't have to ever cook again and just cook me these really delicious things. However, a personal chef would probably make me very fat, and a, per <laughs> a personal masseuse, on the other hand, would make me feel all kinds of much different things. You know something? You disgust me. So, personal masseuse it is, 41%! Nah, I mean, this probably fat people are just voting for personal chef, aren't they? I mean, it'd be great, but masseuse all the way, non-sexual things aside. Would you rather never play video games again, computer games again, or never watch any video on a computer game? It's gotta be never watch it, as like... Like obviously I get that watching it is like like let's plays obviously it's a, it's popular but never like surely you're gonna want to play them yourself like that's a no-brainer right? Wow, okay that's quite surprising. Right, would you rather be chased by 100 rabid squirrels through a flat open plain, very specific, or go down a 200 foot slide completely made out of ice, head first with your shirt off? Right. So the squirrels. Are probably going to be quicker than me. Let's be honest. And a hundred of them would absolutely destroy me. Like a hundred, like they'd cover my entire body. However, going down a slide head first, so that's my chest on something made completely out of ice with my shirt off. Right. It's probably going to have to be the ice thing because there's less chance of me dying. I mean, I may lose my nipples and everything else that's on the front of my body, probably much long, but <laughs> uh, it's, it's 200 foot isn't that long, is it? But hey, I'm probably gonna at least survive. The, the squirrels would destroy me. Would you rather peanut butter first, jelly first? Neither. Who thought that was a good combination? Peanut butter jelly, Americans, what's wrong with you? Peanut butter. Right, it's okay, it's decent, but Jesus Christ, is it the most overrated, overhyped? Like when you see on Instagram, these girls like, ah, this is what I call one serving of peanut butter, and it's a big spoon with massive fucking, like, diarrhea thing of peanut butter on it, and then they just eat it in one go. No, it's, no, it's not that good, it really isn't. But let's just go with peanut butter first. Great, fantastic, that's changed my life, that result. Would you rather be an only child or have one parent. I don't really get how either of those are more beneficial. Only child, I mean, I'd have to say only one parent because only child, from my experience, this is this is me, don't come at me, but only people that are only child, whether it's, it, they may, may not have been planned or not bought, people that are only, that's child, a child on their own, they tend to be a bit like, I don't know, they, obviously because they don't interact with anyone except for like their parents half the time. So it's like, great, let's talk at four years old about politics or something. So one parent it is. Wow, okay, only child. Fair enough. They, they're the people that just want all like the Christmas presents and shit to themselves. So greedy people. Would you rather leave your 90 year old grandma in the car on a hot day with the windows up or leave your dog in the car on a hot day? Oh my God, that is terrible. That's like pick between granny dying or doggo. And we all know that we don't deserve dogs. Dogs are far too like, the like just dogs are great. Dogs are great. We don't deserve them. Granny, I mean, she's lived, she's lived a long life. Granny has 90 years old and of all the ways to go, she's <laughs> She's dehydrated and shriveled up into a little wrinkly sack in the car. So sorry, Granny. See you in a bit. Would you rather play real life Minecraft or real life Mario Kart? That's real life Mario Kart. No, no brainer. However, I feel like I'm going to be outvoted here by all the little rat, ratty nine year olds. No, okay, no, we're good, we're good. Would you rather have 50% of your body burned or 100% of your body tattooed? Now, are we classing things like? eyeballs as tattooed because that is going to be painful obviously 50 percent of your body burn obviously that's painful that is i'm not gonna lie that is gonna be very painful um uh, 100 of your body tattooed i'm talking like are we talking like butthole like schlong uh eyeballs tongue roof of the mouth like that just seems like a lot of pain depending on what the degree the burn is it's not specified the degree so 
first degree burn. I'm guessing that's like the least painful. So I'm just gonna go with it. And I was outvoted, fuck. Okay, would you rather kill five innocent children yourself if it would end all bloodshed in the Middle East for 25 years? <laughs> or it would end all, just for 25 years though. So by the time you, like 25 years time, it's gonna be back again. Or have ongoing wars, terrorism and fighting in the Middle East. That's a bit of a conflict, isn't it? Because five innocent, obviously there's nothing, they've not done anything wrong, but it would end it for 25. If it was, if it said it would end it for life, and maybe I'd be a bit more swayed, but I'm not <laughs> killing five innocent children, especially. Maybe like five innocent grannies, then fair enough, because they're like pretty much dead anyway. Um, have ongoing wars, terrorism, I'm fine. Do you know what? Just go with have ongoing wars because you're never going to keep everyone happy. There's always going to be someone, some politics shit going on. So just, I'm going to have to just bite the bullet and go with that one. I mean, I was in the minority, but fuck it. Would you rather get $100 today or get $1 a day for 200 days? I mean, I'm no mathematician, but hmm, I think one of those is a bit better than the other. Freaking stupid people get $1 a day for 200 days, my God. And 38% of people, it seems, failed maths. Would you rather have to get around on all fours all the time or only make animal noises? I'm not gonna go around on all fours all the time because I look like a riot tit. So, make animal noises because I feel like that would be a bit of a laugh. Hello, Mike. How are you today? <laughs> And I'm in the minority. I, I think the animal noises would be great. Would you rather have an average house in the middle of a city? Sh sh screw cities. Screw cities. Or have a mansion miles away from civilization? That's an introvert uh, night, uh, dream for me. That is 100% mansion. That is crazy. I suppose people more, for people that like this city, fair enough, they would go for that. But me, that's an obvious choice. That is mansion miles away from anybody. Screw, <laughs> fuck you all. I'm out there living in my mansion on my own no one can find me okay would you rather marry same gender i mean this is some fantastic english would you rather marry same gender attractive person so marry same gender attractive person right or marry opposite gender that's beyond ugly well i mean seeing as i'm not gay and i do not partake in the schlong then i will have to go with opposite person that's quote beyond ugly i mean is there a third option of just like be single for the rest of your life because that's really the true answer would you rather chop off your own arm or chop off a complete stranger's arm but they come back to kill you in 30 years who comes up with these <laughs> chop off some stranger's arm because in 30 years i will be 56 my god i will be a granddad um however then by then, are they gonna truly know where you live? Maybe you could be prepared, ready for them with some sort of weapons or something? I don't know, there, there could be a way around it. And I'm just about in the majority there. Okay, would you rather be stalked by Slenderman or take part in one of Jigsaw's games? Now, I know who Jigsaw is, but and he's it's part of Saw and he, you have to complete his games so that you make them die or you don't die or some stupid crap like that. Or be stalked by Slenderman. Slenderman, I'm gonna have to take part in the Jigsaw game. Slenderman, you're in a forest on your own. And once he's got you, you're screwed. Like, your chances of survival, rip. However, Jigsaw, at least, it might not have to be me that partakes in the game. As in, it says take part in one, but sometimes there's more than one person in the room. So maybe I'll be like, Grandma, do you fancy coming along <laughs> to this dark room with me? Would you rather be allergic to peanut butter or be allergic to chocolate? We've already gone over this. Peanut butter is overhyped, overrated. Be allergic to that. Screw it. Yeah, there you go. Look at the freaking landslide that is. That is ridiculous. Would you rather take the cinnamon challenge or take the gallon challenge? The cinnamon challenge, I've done and I passed it and I don't know what people are moaning about. It's freaking easy. All you do is just don't, just breathe through your nose and then you slowly can swallow it. Uh, take the gallon challenge. I think that's the milk one, right? Person given 60 minutes to drink one gallon of milk. Right, so one fucking, uh, clearly give me a gallon in litres. Four litres of milk, four and a half litres of milk. Nah, fam, nah, 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 I'll go cinnamon challenge all day, cinnamon challenge all day. And also, I don't drink milk, you know, because uh, I'm, I, I don't have dairy, fuck dairy. If it was hazelnut milk, then yes, sure, I would drink that all day. Do you realise how stupid you sound? Would you rather lose your preferred thumb? Preferred, who has a preferred, preferred thumb? This is my favourite thumb, because this thumb Helps me win lots of thumb wars. This thumb, however, you can fuck off. Uh, lose your preferred thumb or lose the index and middle finger of your preferred hand. Index and middle finger. That 
I just use that right thumb because I'm just thinking if I'm like cutting things or like, I'm trying to think like logically, I'm not trying to think unlogically. I'm trying to think logically. Uh, if I was to cut something, then sure, yeah, that would make more sense and just, just general, just lose that thumb, screw it. Okay, lastly, 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 would you rather have to smile every waking hour or have to laugh loudly every 30 minutes now? I mean, I'm probably not far off laughing out loudly every 30 minutes. I mean, especially when I do these, I'm probably, it's every like 30 seconds probably. Um, so we shall, huh, I mean, the laughing loudly every 30 minutes, the only thing that's swaying me with that is it would just almost be entertaining um, <laughs> in some real life scenarios. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, Mike, but uh, I have some incredibly bad news. Um, it seems that your grandma, um, five minutes ago, she, she, she happened, she just passed away. I'm, I'm really sorry. <laughs> Anyways, I shall end that video there. We're back. We're back with an old, old school video. So um, if you did enjoy this video, then let me know. Then I can always come back to these. These are these are always very chill. Um, and I don't know, maybe it's always interesting to see how weird I am morally. And maybe I'm doing the absolute opposite to what you would. Um, but let me know either way in the comments below if there's any that really pricked up your ears and you you thought I made the wrong decision or the right decision, then let me know. Uh, but otherwise, I want to thank you so much for watching. Subscribe down below. It is free. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye. Bye.